Hi and welcome back to another video. In today's video we're going to look at the Rubio Monocoat Pre-Colours and Pre-Ages. Now these are designed to be put on the wood piece first and then you use an oil 2C after to seal it all in. Any questions or comments please leave them down below. Let's get into it. So here we have another board. Again it's been prepped exactly the same way. I'm just going to demonstrate a few of the different colours. Now there is 14 of the pre-age and 14 of the pre-colours. I only have a small selection, but this will just give you an idea of how quickly and easily you can change um, a plain piece of wood just with one simple coat. Now I've just got a bit of scrubby here that I've cut up into smaller pieces just for ease of application and not to waste as much. Rubio do say that you can actually apply it in several different ways, brush, rollers or a scrubby. I've only actually actually found that scrubbies or rollers work. Don't apply it direct to the surface either. Always apply it to a piece first. Otherwise you get this nasty staining and so it runs. I'll show you a piece of that later on. So another one of my favourites is the Intense Black pre-colour. Now going from the left to the right we have the white, white 5%, super white, cotton white, then a touch of gold at two C's over the top of it. So this is our 24 hours to dry. So we're just going to take a red pad and give it a very quick denip because the pre-colours and pre-ages are water based. So they could fill up the wood a little bit. So after you've done that just quick wipe with a tack cloth. And now we're ready to put the 2C onto it. So all the layers have divided it up in several sections and we've got a plain untreated piece here which is bare wood just so you can see, sort of see the difference that maybe that a pre-colour or a pre-age can in fact do. Now I'm not going to use the accelerator because it's a sample it's just a waste of product. Again you can use a scrubby to quickly put them on and then we'll let it dry for 10 minutes and then we'll wipe all the excess off with a rag. So here we have the finished pieces. The bottom one is the one that's got the pre-age on it and you can see the distinct difference between the two pieces. So there we have a quick look at the Rubio pre-colours and pre-aging products. Now you will get a different look for every type of oil 2C you put on top of that particular pre-age or pre-colour and also again it'll look different on a different species of wood but at least that gave you some brief insight to what you can do with the pre-aging pre-colours to give you that wider range of available colours to you. Any comments or questions please leave it down below. Thanks for watching. Hello and welcome back. In today's video we have a look at the Rubio Monaco pre-age and pre-colours. Now 